NAFA, INE, continues to broaden its appeal and is now reaching out to people who don't do fleet 100% of the time. 2017 INE is going to be phenomenal. Again, it's the, the, the great thing about INE is that it's planned by fleet managers and their colleagues for fleet managers. But NAFA, in its, its, its continual quest for continual improvement, um, specifically put an INE en enhancement task force in place this year to look at some of the things that we could do differently and some of the things that we could improve and some of the new ways that we could present INE. And so for 2017, you'll see a couple of scheduling tweaks just to make things more uh, cohesive, make things better. You can take more, more advantage of some of the sessions that we're offering. But some of the more uh, underlying things that you might not see is an outreach to other markets. And going hand in hand with the bylaws amendment that we had, reaching out to other new segments that might be involved in fleet management. So there will still be sessions at INE for corporate fleet managers, and government fleet managers, and public service and public safety fleet managers, utility fleet managers. But we're also going to be reaching out to those people that might not be doing fleet 100% of the time, but they do an aspect of fleet. So if you're involved in just risk management or just fuel, you'll be invited to INE to take part in those sessions and you'll be able to register for one day, two days, three days, or four days to make to take advantage of your schedule and the sessions that fit in your in your life and, and in your business.